welcome back to Gloss and Sparkle. So what I have for you today is a little PR haul. Now for those of you guys, I'm sure most of you know what that means, but for those of you who don't, it just means that companies send us YouTubers products to review, to see what we think about them, and we're under no obligation to say positive things about them, we're not being paid, anything like that, but I just thought I'd make a little compilation video of some of the things that I've received lately that I didn't make a separate video on, but I wanted to show them anyway and let you know what I thought of them. So the first company that I want to talk to you guys about is called Raw Spice Bar. They're actually something a little bit different. They have a really neat concept. They have spices that come in the mail each month and each month has a different theme. This month is Oktoberfest. It is the Oktoberfest flavor kit. This is like a super affordable subscription service you guys, especially if you love to cook or if you want to try to get into cooking which is kind of what I'm doing. But it is really inspiring to be able to see these recipes that they send you. So this, like I said, is the October flavor kit and they give you recipes to go with each of the spices that they sent. So these are the ones that they sent me. They come like this, just taped together, but I do actually like their packaging. It seems pretty high quality. So today I received the schnitzel spices, horseradish and mustard seeds, caraway, fennel, and anise bread. So this company has actually come a really long way because I did receive a couple of raw spice bar subscription boxes in the mail. They're not boxes, they're packets. In the mail probably a year ago or a couple years ago. I'm not really sure how long ago it was, but I really wasn't all that impressed. I liked the spices. They were very good quality, but they were really lacking in the packaging department. There were some typos in some of the recipes. I wasn't impressed with that, so I didn't talk about it. But now they have changed all that. They've come such a long way. These are so beautifully vivid. The packaging is very high quality. Even the photography in the recipes are just beautiful now. There's no typos anymore. I love that. This is a really great company. They've done a lot of changes and yes, I am impressed. The next items, I've never heard of this company before. I'm not really sure if it's Mo, I think it's Momo Up. Momo Up, they contacted me and wanted to send out some items. So this is their Finger Cut Makeup Remover Cotton Pads. Now, I actually like this packaging. I think it's really, really neat. And when you open it up, this is what you see. So there are two little finger pads. You put your finger into like the little makeup wipe and you take off your makeup. And this is what the packaging looks like. They actually spend a lot on this packaging because this is pretty high quality. Now, what I have to say about these is that they do remove makeup well. However, when you open this, it is extremely wet inside. I mean, if I squeeze this packaging out after it was open, I could probably get a drip of water out or soap or whatever that makeup remover is. So I don't really like that they're that wet. I wish they were just a little bit drier. I mean, I hate when I open up a makeup wipe and it's completely dried out. That's horrible. But this, they're just a little too wet. However, I love these for taking off liquid lipstick. You know how hard it is to get liquid lipstick off. This takes it right off. So I like that for this. So I will link all of these products and companies down below so you can go check it out if you see something you're interested in. But the next item from Momo Up, I hope Momo Up, Momo, I think it's Momo Up. Anyway, so the next item that I received from them are these oil absorbing sheet rolls. And first of all, the packaging is adorable. That's a little panda bear. How cute is that? So I like this I because I like the absorbing sheet rolls because I love makeup absorbing sheets. However, I wish it wasn't a roll. I mean, I guess that makes it kind of customizable because you can take however big of a piece you want, but I like it, the convenience of just pulling out a little sheet that's pre-cut. And so I kind of feel like that is something that you don't get with this. You don't get that little convenience because that's when I use them is when I'm on the go and I don't have time to cut the sheet to a size I want. I just want to pull it out and do my thing. So that's what I'll say about this. So the next items are from a company that I absolutely love. I love it. You guys are probably familiar with them already. They are carried at Ulta. It is the company called Wish. I actually have done a video, a complete video for them before, not sponsored by the way, and I'll link that below as well. And I fell in love with their products. So the products that they sent this time are their Wish Natural Cleansing Oil. I haven't had a chance to try this. I was so nervous to try cleansing oil for the first time and 
to my surprise it doesn't it doesn't irritate my skin it doesn't make it oily it removes makeup super well so I'm excited to try this I have not yet tried this brand so I am excited because I love wish anyway it is water activated emollient rich gel Ooh, let's see what it looks like and their packaging is gorge as usual so look at this so so pretty so high quality love it so they sent a couple sample size items this is their renewing mud mask excited for that and this is their body butter and almonds there I think the reason she sent me this is because I told her that I just love their almond body butter you guys if you haven't smelled this you need to oh, I can smell it right through the packaging it is so beautiful if you love almond you will love this so the last items that I want to share with you guys are something that I received quite a while ago actually and I just never talked about them I don't think I did. I'm not sure. Maybe I did talk about them. But they are from the company called Madam Glam. This is what they look like. I really like the packaging. It feels like NARS packaging. A lot like NARS. And the colors look good. I've got this pink color in Fiesta and this matte color called Bear Truth. The smell is just, it's killing me. It's literally killing me. It smells like baby powder and plastic. You know what it smells like? It smells like when you were a kid and you got those babies that, those baby dolls that you actually changed so you put baby powder on them when you change your diaper. But you also smell the plastic of the actual baby doll, the skin of the baby doll itself, and just stunk to high heaven. This is what that smells like. I'm not loving it at all. It's so pungent that I literally can't even wear them. I did try to wear one one day and I had to wipe it off because no, 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 no. Take away the scent and we can try again. I don't know. So yeah, not loving that. That was my PR haul, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to check out any of these products or companies, I like I said, we'll leave them linked in the down bar for you guys. So if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!